the long way idea started because you and I met each other a very long time ago. I mean, 20, 25 years ago now almost. And I think our first conversation was about motorcycles. Then we spoke about doing a longer journey and we did Long Way Round. And then, then that was so much fun. We did Long Way Down. And then 12 years later, we, we started talking about Long Way Up. There's this glaring gap in our travels, you know, and that is the Americas. So we always thought that would be the obvious next trip. As a motorcyclist, it's, it's one of the great rides. You go from the bottom of Argentina, Ushuaia, all the way through the Andes, through Central America, and then back up to North America. And it was sort of just seemed to be calling us. Well, at first when it was raised, the electric bike idea, it became an interesting proposition. You know, it became something to really think about. I think electric's for sure the future, and it's quite exciting. When we started looking around for electric bikes, we were looking at everybody. And, you know, obviously, you know, we know who Harley is. I, I don't think we thought that Harley would be making an electric motorcycle. We were just quite enthusiastic about that Harley are really pushing into this new space. With the live wire, the fact that they were sort of leading the fray into this, I thought that was quite exciting. We wanted to be part of that. I think when people see the, the live wire, people are always blown away by how, how kind of cool it looks. Whew. It looks incredible. I was astonished about the acceleration and we started talking about what could be done with it and would you guys be able to make it a little bit more adventure looking for us? Well, what do you think, Charlie? You could be going over the Andes on this. It's an amazing bike. It really is just amazing. We decided to go electric. We got excited about Harley. These bikes were not on a showroom floor and Harley had every reason to say, can't you do this trip in 2021? And they were like, no, you guys need to go now. We're ready to step up and make it happen. You and Charlie approached us with a very singular point of view that this would be an expedition on electric motorcycles. And they were very keen on live wire. I mean, it was early days for us. We were still prototype. There were very few live wires in existence. When they first talked about using the live wire to do this, you know, we, we were in the throes of creating our first adventure touring motorcycle, the Pan America. You know, we had a really good understanding of what an adventure touring motorcycle must be and the expectations that it must fulfill for our customers. And then Ewan and Charlie come to the front door and say, hey, we want to do it on a live wire. And so that was like, whoa, okay, you know. But I tell you what, it took us about, it took us about a half day to come up with the sketch. Livewire is a really great street bike and it's designed to be ridden on the street. And so we definitely, we knew we had to make some changes in order to make it kind of better suited for a trip like this. We had the Pan America, of course, under development, things like the forks and the suspension, some of the vehicle geometry and the ergonomics. A lot of that is kind of inspired by or brought directly from Pan America. You got a couple hours to sketch up a concept of what this thing might look like. And then it was go, go, go to work with the engineering team to make that thing work.